What is going on guys? Wiser here bringing you the recap of the last war for 2.0 It was against this Foxhound 2 clan uh, As you can see it was uh, pretty one-sided not too too interesting of a war um, They did use 63 of 70 attacks so just kind of quickly scroll through obviously a lot of two stars pretty much all the way down the map I think all the way down the map. Yep uh so 2.0 had some fun here uh they got some a lot of shots at th 10 threes and a few of them paid off so that's kind of the theme of this episode uh considering i'm pretty sure i think there's four town hall 10 three stars i have to show you guys so that is exciting uh other than that uh there wasn't too much exciting about this war um as you can see, cleaned up all the way down. So uh, we'll just jump right in, just try and not make this a super long video. Uh, it's pretty late. Although, a lot of Town Hall 10 3 star. So here is Can X beasting it up. Number one versus number one. All right, so 40 40 heroes obviously make a huge difference in your raids. Although, this base is. You know, it's pretty maxed out. There's all the defenses, I think, are Town Hall 10, from what I see. Uh, so all he, all KNX does here is drops his king, drops his queen, jump spell, goes in, takes out the defensive queen, takes out an air defense, I think. His queen should finish the job here. She finishes off the CC troops and locks on that air defense. Perfect. All right, so he still has... Four Lava Hounds and I think like 28 or 30 Balloons. Four Hastes, a Rage, and a Freeze. So he's just going to drop all the Hastes in a line for every group of Balloons. There's one, two, three, boom, boom, boom. Going to Freeze over this core, Rage over this core, and drop another Haste. It's, it's just it's the same fundamentals over and over again, guys. It carries from Town Hall 9. It just carries through. If you can have a minimal investment to take out an air defense, a queen, and a full CC's worth of troops, you're in great position. And that's just, it just, just carries through in every town hall level. This is cleanup. Can X ripped it up. Pops everywhere. Balloons. Good split on the balloons. That's the three. All right, that's your first of a few Town Hall 10 three stars. Our next one, Maverick. Snipes, number three. Not the most amazing base design, but Maverick does a really good job. He's really just going for the two here. And that's kind of the beauty part. His queen really just steps it up and just makes this a three star but again you know he's got tunnel 10 air defenses i think level three infernos level four crossbows everything's moving in i think he had seven golems there just they just buy his king and level 40 hero with so much time you know like king engages the queen she's down this uh, this core is just gonna and getting absolutely shredded now by this queen. She's gonna step up, finish off the town hall. Like there's just so much doing work right now. So the town hall goes down. It's just no problem from here. King's in there tanking. There's still golems in there. And watch kind of the queen just survives on her own on the, the outside here. There's nothing really too much to threaten her. A couple splash damage. That cannon comes in. He's really smart and drops the two wizards. Perfect timing on that. All she's got to worry about is the archer tower. No big deal. Those wizards are going to move in to take out the archer tower. She still has her ability as well. You got to... Keep in mind, he hits it right when the DGBs trigger, which is perfect. Just a sliver of health on that queen. If she didn't survive, this wouldn't have been a three star. I don't think, anyways. 
Like maybe with these wizards coming around the back end. Yeah, no, there's no way. He needed the queen here for the win. That sliver of health got him the three star. Mav, good job, man. Nice three. And what would be a TH10 three star recap without Don Leon putting a couple up on the board? So just jumps right in there with his king, opens it up. I think he might have wanted to get that corner so he could walk in at that air defense. In fact, I'm almost 100% po positive. So he drops the extra wall breakers. Doesn't matter. I don't know why he had the extra anyways. He, maybe he intended. Whatever. Uh, gets the air defense. His queen's going to step up. His king has just long enough to get that defensive queen as low a health as it was. Uh, but this queen's stepping up, going to finish off this dragon. Hopefully. Yeah, I'm going to have to burn the ability, but it doesn't matter. Dragon goes down. Queen's going to continue on there. Typical fashion. Four lava hounds. Four hastes. Freezes. Rage. When you can take an air defense and the defensive queen and the CC troops with such a low value... It's just this strat is 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 in my opinion the way that you do it right like that that's how you got to break it down if that's how you can if you can do that you can town you can three star any town all ten this base wasn't you know all these bases were pretty much max defense town all times and that's the strat you know so for anyone who's new to town hall ten or looking for three star strats that that's how it's done right there and a lot of you yeah they're 40 40 heroes i get it but a lot of the bases you're facing aren't necessarily max town hall tens and the same principles can get applied and the same results can be had so you know stick at it it's not going to happen overnight either this isn't just you don't just pick an army comp and automatically think you're going to three-star Town Hall 10s. Guys like Don Leon and KNX and Mav have been doing this for a very long time. So keep at it. It's going to it's gonna come. Like Look at this. Don had two. Let's check out his next one. Kind of a poor Town Hall 10 base design, in my opinion. But at the same time, you can't just throw... You th just throw a 30, you know, 20... Five wizards and a couple pekkas or something at this you're not gonna get three stars you're just not so here here's what you do right look what's close to the edge air defense right let's zoom in a little bit here air defense queen CC troops that's the theme of this video he doesn't care that the king's walking his job's done the queen is dead when there's a queen exposed on the edge like that, and as a Town Hall 10, you can literally just drop your two heroes and get that value. Look at it. 29 balloons, four Lama Hounds. All his spells can be concentrated on this air attack. So, hey, surprise, surprise. Two Lava Hounds, two more Lava Hounds. He's going to, guess what? Horseshoe of Haste around the rim. He's going to rage over the core and freeze. I don't know how many times I say that in recaps here. But, you know, that's how it's done. You want to break it down and you really want to do true three-star attempts against Town Hall 10s. It's exactly what these guys are doing. Don absolutely killing it. Right through the core. It's really only this 6 o'clock area of defense is up. Even air skeletons as a surprise. But it doesn't matter. Look at this. Like uh, 29 balloons he brought. That's just... <laughs> if you deploy correctly and you drop your Lava Hounds at the right times and you get those three components with an Air Defense, the Archer Queen, and the CC Troops with just your heroes, you got a pretty good shot at three-starring a Town Hall 10. Don Leon with a six-star war. Good job, man. All right, I'm only going to show, because we already showed four attacks. I'll show one Town Hall 9 here. I had one that stood out a little bit. The Wolfman. Iron Wolf. 
coming in at this base, <laughs> he just not the not the best of bases, right? But especially for you know, I, I don't know if those net. I mean, twenty and twenty one heroes, not super high, but Iron Wolf just crushes this base. It's I watched a lot of attacks and I was trying to find out which one Town Hall Nine attack I was gonna show, and I none of the bases were too fantastic. So it wasn't really about base design, it was about how many troops were left over at the end of the attack. So, sorry, I accidentally hit times two, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, but he sends, in a quick times two fashion, eight Valks, or six Valks into the core here, under a heal. He went in with the shattered entry, Queen's kind of just doing work, sends in the Hogs in a clockwise fashion, started started over here, he's just kind of sprinkling, sprinkling them in, uh, a few at a time. It's gonna drop one more heal here for them. I don't think he needs the heal. And down in this section, he honestly did not need that heal whatsoever. He's got a cannon and archer tower. Oh, there was a under leveled bomb there. But <laughs> oh, and he even lost four hogs to that very last spring trap. But to look, he's got I'm pretty sure every Valkyrie is still alive. His golem is unbusted. His heroes are full health. He has almost every hog left. I, he could count how many troops he lost in this battle on, I think, both hands. Wolf killed it. Ow! All right. Not a very interesting war, but again, it's nice to get those those little breaks sometimes. Um, you get to try some things that you definitely don't normally try in a, any sort of a range match or difficult matchup but uh good job 2.0 i know you guys have some uh interesting matchups on the horizon that's for sure uh just randomly matched up with exclusive nation it's kind of unfortunate in a sense but we'll learn more as a clan um, than you do in these farming wars farming wars are just kind of to let loose and uh, not have to have quite the same kind of pressure on you as when you're in an arranged match. But um, yeah, so we'll see how it goes against Exclusive Nation. And then I know there's some actual arranged matches against Fair Play Clans uh, coming up as well uh, behind that for the uh, in the weeks to come. So uh, we will definitely have lots more content coming the way to labs. And obviously we're still new and still working on a lot of things and getting labs going again and and everything so i hope you guys have been enjoying and please obviously leave your feedback because i just want to make this better for you guys and uh you know i'm still fairly new to this myself so uh guys great war 2.0 just killed it crushed these guys got a little bit of relaxation uh, before something like exclusive nation so hopefully that's good uh until next time guys i'm wiser i'm out